Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Sense and Swoke, sharing brands we love. Today is episode number 19, and I'm happy to share with you another new bottle of wine from Australia. But before I talk about this brand, I just want to explain to you what is the whole idea of my channel. So Sense and Swoke is all about product review and opinion based on the world of wine and spirits. Besides wine and spirits, I will also uh, share things which related to scents. So if um, you want to support my channel, consider subscribing. That way you will help me uh, in order for me to grow the channel. Today, I want to talk about this bottle of wine by Yellowtail Pure Bright Chardonnay 2020. So as we know that Australia are famous for the red wine Shiraz also known as Shira in some parts of the world. But today I'm not talking about Shiraz, instead I'm talking about Chardonnay from Yenda, Australia. This bottle of wine contains 9.6% alcohol by volume by Casilla Wines. The sugar content is 9 grams per liter. Sweetness descriptor is described as dry. The varietal is Chardonnay. The price of this bottle is $12.95 Canadian dollars. There are a few things that I want to tell you before I start talking about this bottle of wine. Number one, it begins with Filippo and Maria Casella selling all the way from Italy to Australia to find a better way of life and eventually they settle in Yenda, New South Wales. After many years of hard work and struggle, it was 2001 that really changed for the family. Initial plan is to sell 25,000 cases but in reality, the sales were over 1 million cases in just 13 months. Yellow Teal is a wine that is easy to drink, share, and most importantly, enjoy. For more details, please check out the link below the description. That way you can have more details about the brand as well as the winery. So let's look at the glass, as you can see right here. So. Yeah, this wine is leaning towards uh, medium yellow color. You can see that it's pretty yellow. Nosing the wine is so important before you drink it because our nose is very sensitive and we can pick up a lot of different flavors through our nose. So it's very important for us to nose the wine first. On the nose, predominant flavor of uh, honeycomb melon as well as pineapple with subtle uh, oaky and vanilla undertone uh, when it comes to the flavor. Let's taste the wine. This wine is nice and crisp, buttery with moderate acidity, refreshing and flavor of peach, pineapple and citrusy. I'm going to taste the wine one more time and before I tell you what's I, uh, what do I think in terms of the finishing, okay? This wine is overall creamy, yet buttery, finished with uh, lemon and sado coconut, long-lasting finish. I begin to love this wine. It is pretty buttery and silky in a way. Um, where it comes to the flavor of the wine. To be honest, I don't see many people review this bottle of wine yet. And when it comes to uh, the product review, I would like to rate this bottle of wine 3.8 overall uh, out of five stars. With 80, 80 to 84, a solid well-made wine. What do you need to do when you have a good bottle of wine right in front of you? Obviously, you need to pair with the correct type of food. So uh, let me start with savory. So this wine goes very well with lobster, with garlic butter sauce, like I mentioned, because it's buttery. So I think it blends pretty well with the butter as well. You can uh, pair this wine with poultry and white varieties of seafood. So when it comes to the dessert variety, pair this bottle of Yellowtail Pure Bright Chardonnay 2020 with peach and cream bars, strawberry cobbler or orange souffle. And if I have to mention this wine in a couple of words, 
I would like to mention this wine as honeycomb flavor, buttery, creamy, as well as tart. Guys, thank you very much for watching to the end of episode number 19. So next week, I will review another uh, bottle of wine, which is number 20, and I will wrap up the series of wine below $15. Thank you very much for the time for watching. I really appreciate it. Please subscribe to my channel as well as click the notification button as well. And next time when I post more video, you'll be notified. And till we meet again, cheers.